Hello, uh, we are back and I will show you the next features of LibaLiba Liba model version. Today I will show you how we can resolve a conflict using LibaLiba Liba model version while working with other people and a subversion or SVN repository. First of all, we need to bring up EA and do some changes to our working copy. In this case, I just rename a state and <clears throat> hit OK. After I change the state, uh, we search for a second state that is uh, not shown on the diagram and we will also rename this one. So just remove something from the name uh, that should be good enough for the demo. After I'm done with my changes, I close my Enterprise Architect or I close at least the model and I'm back in the File Explorer and I choose Commit from the Tutoir menu and because I'm a nice developer, I always add a Commit comment. I hit OK and uh, something is not working which means I, need, I have a conflict with my model. Somebody else on my team changed the model while I had it working. So I have to resolve the conflict. Uh, Liba Liba model version of UI opens. I can see there is a conflict highlighted in orange. Uh, one state was renamed and another state was deleted by my colleague. Uh, of course, I want to keep the state and revert the deletion, so I choose take all mine. One of the very nice features of, of the Liba Liba UI is that you can also see visually what changed on your diagram. In this particular example it's not very exciting because we didn't really alter the diagram, just rename a state, uh, but I think you get the idea uh, that you see a visualization of what happened. Once I'm done, I hit Start Merge. A new uh, Enterprise Architect repository is generated and I choose Resolved. And I can check in and we are done. We have a new re a revision of the model. Would you like to work like that? Feel free to contact us at any time. Thanks for listening. Talk to you soon.